Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of My Life Lemons. If you are new here, thank you so much for checking out this video. I really, really do appreciate it. And again, welcome. Okay guys, today the scent that I will be reviewing for you is Fresh Vanilla by Victoria's Secret Pink. Okay, so this is the packaging for this fragrance mist. Um, we have a, a rose gold plastic lid. Uh, the nozzle is silver and the um, bottle is clear and the liquid inside it does have a bit of tint to it okay it's like a uh, creamy I mean it looks like a light creamy color and then the wraparound packaging okay so this is the design in front it looks like um, uh, it has this melted design and here okay to me it looks like a scoop of a vanilla ice cream and then yeah it's starting to melt <laughs> okay so this bottle has 250 milliliter of product okay so at the back there isn't much anything at the back so it says a fresh vanilla twist i think that is a um, orchid right there and this is the vanilla bean and we do have ingredients as well okay so that is the packaging for fresh vanilla okay um let's go on ahead and read the scent notes it says that fresh vanilla has vanilla bean and orchid um i feel like i did try to look up um other notes for this fragrance mist but i believe that i wasn't able to find any so yeah, because if I did, I would have taken a note of it, but I, I feel like I've, I wasn't able to find any other fragrance notes for this um, fragrance mist. Okay, so let's go on ahead with a review of Fresh Vanilla. Okay, so this, um, oh, by the way, let me um, spray this on for you guys. I am not in love with the uh, nozzle of this mist because I will show you. I, I don't know if you saw that. Uh, yeah, it wasn't dispersed finely, the, the mist. Okay, so so when I first tried uh, Fresh Vanilla, I mean the first time that I was able to test it out, it reminded me a lot of um, Dahlia. Yes, it reminded me of Dahlia because uh, Dahlia is like a floral it's a vanilla i mean the tonka bean scent and yeah but that scent is more perfumey but this one it doesn't go perfumey at all at least not on me and um the first thing that i get from this fragrance mist is that fresh vanilla scent okay so i've been wearing this for uh four days now okay um the vanilla scent that I get on here sometimes at the beginning, I get like a, a vanilla ice cream vibe, but it's not too gourmand, you know, like it smells like if vanilla ice cream, but the vanilla ice cream isn't in front of you. You know, it's, it's not that creamy, very rich um, vanilla ice cream scent. It's more like the vanilla ice cream smells like it's somewhere near you like somebody else is sitting um, next to you and they're eating vanilla ice cream you know kind of like that but uh, after that vanilla uh, scent uh, immediately i do get the uh, floral note as well okay it says that this one has orchid um i can honestly uh, say that it does give me orchid vibes but to me, I think there might be another floral note on here. Like, but I can, I cannot pinpoint what floral note it is. But there is something. Yes, there is something. But yeah, I don't know what it is. Because to me, uh, this isn't just orchid. So after a few seconds, uh, a minute tops, uh, the vanilla note on here it's it slightly deepens and you honestly get that uh vanilla 
pain now, you know? And I guess that is the a reason why I am um, reminded of Dahlia. Actually, Dahlia is here. I took her out because I wanted to um, compare it a bit. So Dahlia is a perfumey vanilla floral scent, but this one has tonka bean, while uh, fresh vanilla has vanilla bean. I mean, I can smell like a similarity of that maybe bean vibe right there, but definitely this one has a more like a potent um, tonka bean uh, scent. Uh, this one, yeah. It's more like, yeah, it's a fresh vanilla bean um, fragrance. It's just slightly more uh, lighter than Dahlia. And again, this is not as perfumey as Dahlia as well. I mean, I don't think it's perfumey at all. I'm sorry about that. Okay, so when that vanilla scent on here um, deepens a bit, um, I also get that sweetness with it but it's not like a very like gourmand sweetness no it's like the sweetness is uh very balanced with that vanilla note and that floral note and to me it smells uh pretty this is a very pretty uh vanilla floral scent mm. i mean right now i'm smelling my um the back of my hair and it's so good okay and what's interesting is that I don't really have um, much to say about this body mist because, you know, with my um, other uh, fragrance re reviews, I I sometimes tell you, okay, after 30 minutes, I get this. After an hour, it goes to this and that and blah, blah. But with this one, it's just that, you know, once you get that va vanilla bean note along with that floral, that's it. I mean, yeah, it does deepen. Um, it, it does deepen to that sort of like a creamy vanilla floral scent. And it has a sweetness to it. And it's very pretty. I do kind of love this scent, but I don't want to say that I'm in love with it. Okay? Because it's very pretty. I like the creaminess that I get on here. It's not that, you know... Um, you know, sometimes with this, with Dahlia, sometimes can go a little bit mature or grown. But with this one, it's like, but if you like Dahlia, but you don't, um, maybe if you don't like the pear note on here, maybe if you find the tonka bean a little too strong for you, I don't know. Um, this is a good alternative to Dahlia, okay? And yeah. Like I said, okay, so fresh vanilla, it's it's kind of like a simple scent because it doesn't go to a lot of different phases. It doesn't transition to, you know, uh, a different scent. It's simple, but in a very good way, okay? And I do, yeah, I kind of do love this scent. Okay, so let's talk about longevity. Um, fresh vanilla on my skin, uh, it lasts for about two and a half hours to three hours sometimes the scent um, on the last half an hour on the third hour it does go very light um, obviously a fragrance mist they will go um, softer I mean the longer it wears it will go softer and that's normal but after that third hour um, I do get a skin scent from a fresh vanilla and I love the skin scent that I get from here because okay so once that uh, skin scent sets in um, weirdly I get a bit of like a musky scent again it's weird because um, while this scent uh, lasts on my skin that two and a half to three hours I don't get any musky scent at all okay I, I'm just getting that creamy vanilla floral scent and i don't know i i don't smell like a musk scent with those um fragrance notes but when the skin scent uh, sets in that is the only time that i do get a bit of like a musky musky note and 
it's not bad i kind of like the musky scent that i get when that skin scent sets in and um weirdly the skin scent lasts for another uh five to six hours like it lasts on my skin i would compare it to my other arm that's bare and yeah it lasted for like five to six hours more so so i really cannot complain so fresh vanilla on my clothes this scent i mean this body mist lasts for about eight hours maybe stretching to nine or ten hours but yeah basically this lasts for eight hours on my clothing okay which is a little um unexpected to me because sometimes um with vanilla scents they always last much longer than that i mean maybe 12 hours or so or 18 hours because this one uh dahlia is pretty long lasting and yeah i was expecting for fresh vanilla to just um last as long at least on my clothes oh by the way i also compared this to um twinkling nights because uh this is also a a uh, floral vanilla this has frosted jasmine petals whipped vanilla and mandarin blossom yes um they don't really smell anything alike um the jasmine note on here and that uh, bit of mandarin blossom um yeah it's uh i would have to say that they would probably uh, belong to the same scent profile but they do not smell alike at all yeah even the vanilla note on here yeah it's definitely um different from the vanilla um scent that you get from fresh vanilla okay so uh fresh vanilla i would recommend for those who are into vanilla and very much into florals as well because this is not a gourmand vanilla definitely it's not a gourmand vanilla but it does have a gourmand vibe okay um like i said on that first application i'm reminded of a vanilla ice cream scent but um as it wears on i do i do get uh that floral note on in here and it's very um you know it's very noticeable it's not like uh it's it's not like just a hint of floral i mean basically to me this is like 50 no maybe 60 oh no uh, I, I feel like this is maybe like 55 percent vanilla and then 45 percent floral because i would have to say that um the vanilla note on here slightly dominates the um body mist but basically this is a vanilla floral scent okay um this is not very gourmand so if you like vanilla and you like florals definitely yeah you have to get this uh fragrance mist this body mist um i would um suggest this to um late teens and up definitely uh and this one is also a very feminine scent so fresh vanilla uh 100 i do recommend this body mist um, I even think that this can be a good everyday scent. I mean, I wouldn't mind um, wearing this scent every day because it does smell really, really good. Okay, so that is it for my review of Fresh Vanilla, guys. If you like this review, please do give it a thumbs up. If you have any scent suggestions, any questions, or any comments at all, please write them down below and I will be happy to check them out, okay? And then if you want to watch more uh, fragrance mist reviews, please, please, please do not forget to subscribe. And everybody, guys, please do take care and be safe wherever you are. And I will see you on the next video. Goodbye, guys.